Viking shields used to be from 75 to 100 centimeters long, wide. So this is almost 80. It's a big one. So first of all, the wood. I use this type of wood. It's it's for ceilings. It's one and a half centimeters. Thick and 10 centimeters wide. I cut the joints, positive and negative joint, so it's gonna be straight from both sides. After that, I put all together. After you need the round piece, it's very easy to, to make it. You take a smaller piece of wood. Nail it in the middle, and then you take pencil and you do around so you have a big circle. Then you have to make the, the hole for the boss and the hand. So, we cut a piece like this, we cut a piece like this, and after we will have something like this. Before you cut the cycle, you need to join all the pieces together, so you need a stripe like this. I use this one, it's almost 2 cm thick to 5 cm. So I use it to join all the pieces together and also make the handle like this. For the body, I use this kind of nails use always nails with head because I wanted to you to see uh, seem old enough and from the other side I just turn them inside or cut them if I cut a few also you can cut them or you can tear them whatever so you have cut the shield around, you have cut the hole for the hand, but now the boss. For the boss I use this. This is a plate to feed the dogs. So I took this and I cut it here. All around, so I have this piece off. So I took out this and I straightened the edge so I could nail it to the shield. If you don't have a, a small anvil or uh, some hard surface, it's always to use a small hammer with an even smaller hammer and you. You just you to straighten the edge. 
for this I use a very thin piece of metal that I found in the wood supplier it's used to hold the, the woods together so I nail it around and then cut it I cut small pieces here here and here and then turn it over and nail it again so it's not really round but it does work I use uh, 3 cm nails with head also so they can hold the piece of metal in place but this is not so hard so as you can see I have heated already and it's not so it's very thin so don't have can't stand any heat so I would not recommend to use it for uh, real duel or battle or whatever so when the shield is finished you can paint it you can put a piece of leather on it or whatever you want I just want the shield to, for you know to hang it on, on my wall to mount it on my wall so I made this I took these things join corners I think it's called and I turned the side on one side so when I will paint my shield I will put this thing on the wall I will install this thing on the wall with two drills and I will have my cool shield hanging on my wall Thanks for watching, enjoy!